Hello everyone, it's Enigma here, and welcome back to yet another episode of Moveset Mondays. Now, on today's episode of Moveset Mondays, we're going to be talking about Spring Man. Now, Spring Man is, is Nintendo's, is, is a character from Nintendo's newest IP, which is ARMS. And Spring Man just makes so much sense to be in this game. He comes from a fighting game, a Nintendo IP from the Switch era. It just makes so much sense, you know? I mean, I'd be totally surprised if we do not see Spring Man in this game. And we all know that Nintendo loves to promote their games. So if they want to promote ARMS, they should add Spring Man into the game. And he has a lot of moveset potential. So, and what better way to, to hope for Springman being in Smash than to talk about his potential movesets? That's right, on today's episode of Moveset Mondays, we're going to be talking about Springman. So anyway, let's get right to it. But before we actually get there, though, there's something I gotta tell you guys before we get into the, into the moveset thing. Um... Now, personally, people have been saying that Springman will be too boring to be in the game as the arms representer. But Springman is the main character, so, you know, it would make sense to add Springman. So what I did was, instead of using Springman's basic attacks, um, they could use that for the special and jabs and tilts and stuff, Springman's attacks. But for his special moves, he can use the uh, attacks from the other arms characters. And th that that would just make a lot of sense if they wanted to really make Springman interesting. So yeah. Anyway, now let's get right to it. So anyway, his neutral spe special will be Mechanica's Revolver. It's a triple punch with cooldown, and it has tons of versatility. You know, it, it's much better than what Springman could do with his neutral special, and you know, it would make a lot of sense as the neutral special. So yeah, Mechanica's Revolver definitely the neutral special. The side special would be Ninjara's Chakram. It's a multi-hit move that can be angled into any direction. So yeah. Again, it'd be a, a lot better than what Springman could do, and, you know, it, this would be a, a, a really great attack for a side, a side special. I don't know where I got that from. Uh, <laughs> um, his up special would be Ribbon Girl's Slamamander. It works similar to All Mars Recovery from Brawl, but and Springman could swing his arm onto a ledge and to grab onto it, and and can use it on the ground as an attack option. So yeah, it's basically similar to Almar's uh, uh, recovery from Brawl. And, you know, it would make a lot of sense. I, re I mean, I really don't know what else could be his up special. So yeah, definitely the Slamamander attack. Um, the down special would be Master Mummy's Big Punch. It's a slow but powerful move that could be a great KO move. So yeah, basically he unleashes a big attack it's very slow, but it can do a lot of it, uh, a lot of damage if you time it correctly. So yeah, and besides, I don't know what else could be his down special besides that. So, and final smash, and the final smash would be the arm barrage. He swings his arms multiple times, then and then a final blow with a really huge punch as a KO move. So it's basically similar to the Master Mummy punch. But it's, it's a lot more powerful because of the arm attack, you know, him, like, barraging his arms. So, yeah, that would make a lot of sense for his final smash. So, yeah, this has been another episode of Moveset Monday. Stay tuned for the next Moveset Mondays that will be, obviously, on Monday. So, anyways, I hope you guys enjoy this episode of Moveset Mondays. And feel free to comment what you think Springman's moveset would be in the comments. And, tell, and let me know what character you want to see featured in the next Moveset Mondays. So, anyway, this is Enigma, and peace. See you next time.